Some fight, huh? Dempsey Carpentier. That fight hasn't happened yet. You're dreaming, Nucky. I guess. <laughs> oh yeah, right, he got shot last episode, so... <laughs> Daddy eats first. <laughs> and there's the food for Daddy, huh? I'm a clerk with Esther Randolph's office. Who? The assistant U.S. attorney. This is a subpoena calling for your testimony pursuant to an ongoing investigation. That's a subpoena. Get the hell out of here. What do you want with my son? Hey! Grandpa! Oh. Uh, Dad, calm down. Just a subpoena. Your friend from Chicago's in the fucking morgue. God rest the soul. That's all you gotta say? Dude, much this unusual. was your fault. Knock off the jokes, <laughs> Al. He was supposed to do a job. You vouch for this fella and now Nucky's still alive? Yeah, point your fingers now. So what was that even? Did Jimmy not even know about that guy? That he walked right into that guy's direction and in doing so brought Nucky's attention to him too? There's a bug going around. Nothing to worry about. Get the car. Kitty. Mom? Oh, Kitty. You're not... The number one girl anymore. Is he taking his meals here now? Just coffee, ma'am. Take the children to Lillian, please. Come on now. Off with you both. What was that even? Is he taking his meals here now? He's working for Nucky, so why shouldn't he be here? What the fuck? It's not like Katie invited him. I'm very sorry. Who's dead? Pops? Your father has died. Let's celebrate, maybe. Or oh, let's burn his, burn his corpse first. Ingrid, is it? Secret. Oh, this must Your room be. is the first one off the hall where you will also sleep with the child. You do understand it is seven days a week. I must require some time to myself. Sundays, once a month. <clears throat> do you not wish to kiss her goodbye? I did that before you came. <laughs> I wouldn't call it love yet. <laughs> Nucky Thompson's still alive. Any idea what happened there? Well, he is. He's got a beef with his brother. I would have thought James Dormady myself. Dormady ain't got it in him. Pillow talk, Charlie? <laughs> yes, his mother confirmed. He doesn't have it in him. <laughs> Manure. What can you expect when you conduct your business in a stable? <laughs> Was he just saying, they are full of shit? <laughs> it was Mr. Lathrop here who saved your life. I believe a thank you would have been in order. He did his job. <laughs> your skirt's too short. It's the law, lady. The bottom of the skirt shall be no higher than seven inches above the knee. They actually measure. Ten dollars. What? I don't have that kind of money. Fine, then you can spend the night in jail. <laughs> Run. <laughs> My cousin is a joker. If you let me pay the fine, I'll be sure to keep her out of trouble. Gee, you'd do that, cuz? <laughs> I'm so glad Angelo gets another storyline with a woman. <laughs> About time. So you're a novelist? I am. And what do you do? I'm still trying to decide. I thought you're a painter. I mean, you're not really doing anything else. I paid you $5,000 for alcohol. I don't have it yet. Got a house such as this? My father's, not mine. A man wants. Comes to my shop with a deer. I offer the butcher the animal. Innocent steak. I've eaten venison, if that's what you're wondering. I can see that butt trick. And that you hid behind Papa when he pulled the trigger. <laughs> I'm sorry about your father. People die. Is that all you'll say? What do you want to hear? <laughs> a surplus. Made for the war. I got 3,000 of them down in the cellar. Who knew your Kaiser would chicken out so soon? <laughs> Just loud enough so that guy could hear it. <laughs> the pups have grown fangs, gentlemen. Kill the prick. I'm under indictment. The feds are up my ass. Then take a plea. Retire someone. What? All my money's tied up at the land deal. Will Rothstein do, do it? Do nothing. Oh, never mind. 
<laughs> Let's just wait it out. Some days I make 20 bets. Some days I make none. There are weeks, sometimes months in fact, when I don't make a bet at all because there simply is no play. So I wait, plan, marshal my resources. And when I finally see an opportunity and there is a bet to make, I bet it all. I guess that means... Please wait, Mr. Thompson. Wait for the season finale. Then you go all in. Police meeting free. We're federal agents, and that's against regulations. We should be going. You forgot to pay, dude. <laughs> Southampton. That's where my boat left from when I came over from Ireland. I'm gonna do that too. Sail a big ship like Sinbad straight over the waves. Your turn, Uncle Naki. No time for turns. Uncle Naki's busy scheming. I'd like you to start calling me Dad. Would you like that, Teddy? Yes. Yes. Shouldn't you maybe marry first? Hmm? He was a popular man, huh? <laughs> was Nucky just early? What are you doing here? I have as much right to be here as you do. I'm surprised as all. That it's not me in the box? <laughs> <laughs> I'm here for Mother. And for Susan. They're all together now. Heaven? <laughs> Pops Even if it existed, heaven? do you actually think <laughs> that son of a bitch would be there? <laughs> Was he that bad? Lucky. You've obviously forgotten key events from our childhood. That turned out okay. So did you? Yep. <laughs> I mean, you're criminals, both of you. But you turned out fine. His feet are smelling this bad. Clifford Lathrop? Yes. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> you can't accept that. It's clearly a bribe. You're a peach. <laughs> My father passed on Monday. You gentlemen should know that. Cop! I'm sorry. Do you hear that? He's making progress. Give him a couple of years and he's back to his old self. Now you can have it back. Atlantic City and all that goes with it. Stepping down as treasurer? I am. And you gentlemen have my word that I will not stand in your way. Choose whomever you'd like as my successor. You're not standing in their way, but... You're sneaking up on them from behind, maybe? <laughs> is that really the best hiding place? And what kind of money is that anyway? In your house, you said your people were behind you. The thousands of black folks that make this city run? Do it. Call a strike. <laughs> In the middle of Taurus season, who shut the city down? Exactly. <laughs> you showed us what you want. Doesn't matter to me. In about 30 minutes, it won't be my problem. <laughs> Let me bow before the king. While you're down there, why don't you kiss my ass? <laughs> hmm? What brings you here? Me? I guess a celebration. I need a word. All right, in a minute. Uh, Eli wants to ruin the happiness once again. <laughs> it's a new day, and the war is over. And to the victors go the spoils. Yeah. Yeah. Prince James, long may he reign. Yeah. I'm sure his reign is going to be over by the end of the season. <laughs> He's not made for this at all. He doesn't look comfortable. He doesn't look confident or strong. He's just a soldier, not a leader. I want you to set up a meeting. Me and John McGarrigal in Belfast. We'll set sail immediately. You tell him I have a proposition. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. He wants to sneak up from behind. My brother, he's smarter than you are, and a lot more dangerous. Fuck you, Eli. Come here to piss all over my party. <laughs> yeah. 
That's what I think. Calm down, join the party. All right, all right. Yeah, sure, we'll be right down. Hey! Oh. <laughs> Fucking moron. Making enemies on day one? Clever. She's warm again. Do you want her cold? No. <laughs> she might end up cold though. Hmm.